Hello, my name is Kim Miller. I'm a lead profitability coach with Inspired Hygiene. I'm a columnist for RDH Magazine, and I'm a national speaker, as well as the co-founder of periofrogs.com. One of the things that's amazing about what I do when I work with clients is that I have the opportunity to go into a lot of different dental offices to work with a lot of different team members from a considerable amount of varied demographics. Recently, I was in a client's office in the Sacramento area, and they had this posted in their lunchroom, if you will. The power of 632. So there's something really interesting about these 11 words, and it really struck me that this dental team really tries to live into the power of 632 every single day. So let's just take a look at these. Do what you say you'll do. Six little words, do what you'll say, you say you'll do. And a couple of guidelines here is don't agree to do something unless you're absolutely sure that you can complete it and follow through with it. And secondly, be honest with yourself and with others. Thirdly, if you find that you've overcommitted yourself, don't make excuses, don't shift the blame to someone else, own up to it and let the chips fall where they may and pick them up and move on as best you can. And also I think it's important for us to remember that it's okay to say no. One of the things that I realize about my personality and the personality of other dental professionals that I work with is that we really like to take on a lot. And I don't think there's anyone that's listening to this video, myself included, that hasn't agreed to do something that we actually didn't follow through on and didn't get done. So word to the wise, right? Don't agree to something you can't do. The power of three here, do it right to the best of your ability. And if you can't do it right, ask someone to help you. Ask someone with the expertise and the knowledge to pitch in and help and don't be afraid. One of my personal mottos is if you never ask, the answer is always no. So if you're gonna do it right and you need to ask for help, be sure you do that. And then finally, finish it. Once again, I know that everyone listening to this video has found themselves working on a project that they were unable to finish or complete, maybe not, maybe in a timely manner or just not finish it at all. Again, if you find yourself as a dental team member having committed to do something, you set your intention to do that, but yet you were unable to finish it, go ahead and ask for help. So I'm gonna tell you the overarching aspect of these powerful 11 words. Do what you say you'll do. Do it right and finish it. And don't be afraid to say you couldn't follow through and ask for help. Remember, if you never ask, the answer is always no.